In today's video, we're gonna talk about the procedural SDR lighting add-on. This add-on helps you in creating easy procedural lighting environments inside Blender while having complete customization over many things with just a few clicks. This add-on provides a lot of versatility in different Blender projects because first, you can choose to play with the sky settings which will influence the entire lighting of the world or you can choose to play with the room settings which control the light inside the room. We can also create skies for both EV and cycles. So you have options when you implement this add-on in all projects that you need, which is fantastic. In the sky tab of the add-on, you have different options like the color panel in which you can change the saturation and hue of the sun. You can also add a background blur to it as well. Also, one of the different options you have is the sun settings, in which you can control stuff like the elevation and rotation of the sun, the power of the sun, and the softness of the shadows. In the sky panel, you can change the different colors emitted from the sky and make it a gradient through the color ramp. You can also bump up the aesthetics and realism of the sky, especially nice skies, by adding stars. You can also customize the clouds in the SDR image by changing different parameters like the alpha density and color. You can even change how the clouds appear in motion, in addition to the amount of shading they affect and their rotation. In addition, you can add multiple light boxes, which will serve as extra lighting lamps. Furthermore, you can change the color, power and rotation in the X, Y and Z axes, and you can also change the number of divisions in the X and Y axes. And if you have a limited period of time to work, then you can play with different presets that the add-on provides. From the room settings, you can play with windows and room settings in which you can change the color and power and you can also change the width and height of the window lights. And if you like an SDR image that you created and you want to export the image to be used in different Blender projects or take it to a different software, the procedural SDR lighting add-on allows you to take the HDRI texture in different resolutions ranging from 1K textures to 16K textures. So we can see why this add-on is powerful as it saves you time when it comes to searching for HDRIs, in addition to the fact that sometimes you can find the right ones. So this add-on can help you while providing you with a lot of settings and presets to play around with. If you are interested in this add-on or the amazing add-ons that the same developer has, you will find the necessary links in the description. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. You can also check some of our previous videos. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.